Hello, I'm the CNC Repairman, and in this video, I'm gonna show you how to use the Easy Umbrella tool to remove the umbrella plate. This tool ratchets up by pushing to push the umbrella plate, and if you wanna lower it, you just push on the little knob. The tools you're gonna to want are a quarter inch driver for a ratchet, and you're gonna need two threaded rods that come with the tool. Start by removing a couple of the bolts. I know that I'm inside this machine and it doesn't have any sheet metal. That's better for videoing, but it should be just fine and you should be able to do this inside of your machine or through the window. Go ahead and thread both the threaded rods into the hole. These, these rods are going to help hold up the easy tool. Now install the easy tool and I could ratchet it up or I can just push the rod and push it all the way up to where it's holding the entire plate. Now I'm going to remove the rest of the bolts and it's going to rest entirely on the easy tool. The second threaded rod helps keep the plate from rotating when installing or removing. Plates on older machines are usually going to be full of chips and coolant and be quite heavy. So be ready for that, and you may get some coolant on you. All the bolts are out. I'm gonna step back a little bit and push up, and then lower this tool. There it goes, whoo! A little bit of juice there. Let's go ahead and just give this a little bit of a wobble, and it should come right down. There it goes, and it's just gonna walk it down. And there's the plate, hanging just on the easy tool and ready to be replaced. So I would just carry this all the way down, and then the next one, I'd push it up in here just until it locks, push it all the way up and install the new one. Here it goes, putting it back up. Got it. All the way up. Now we're going to take some of these bolts and help do it the last little bit. Go ahead and just drop this. And I've got this plate back installed. If you'd like to get an easy umbrella tool, take a look at cncreplacementparts.com. There you can pick up one of these easy tools, and it comes with two pieces of threaded rod. If you don't have this tool, you're stuck like this, working on your back underneath the machine. And if it's a big one, you're lucky you can do it from the front. But this is way, yeah, just get the tool. Mm -hmm. 